Shut up with the yours, okay? I am never going to fix that. Never. Good f***ing luck. Hey, Chatty. Hey, Kitty. How are you? I'm well. How are you feeling? How are you? Uh, you know. Still sad. I know. You know what's going on? I, I can imagine. I can only imagine your pain. I ran into her one time and I just broke down in tears when she just saw me as like... A distant stranger. She doesn't remember you? No. Well, she remembered that we used to race together from years ago, but she oh. didn't know that we were close. Yeah. She doesn't remember Max. Like, yeah. Yeah, it's not good. But I'm hopeful. I was literally mourning a loss of a best friend that day. I was, like, in shambles, and... She called me and we caught up for hours. And I'm not pulling your leg. Moments of cups came out. Really? Yeah. When I saw her, she was like this low tone. She kept saying she feels empty. She doesn't feel anything inside. And she just wasn't even talking like Ray the Raymond that I knew. Wait, she told you that? Mm-hmm. I yucking knew it. But um, but then I was just listening to her vent about like, you know, what like what's happened to her since she's woken up. And then she started pacing. She just started pacing and she started yapping while pacing. And I just smiled and I told her, I was like, you're doing the exact thing Chatty told me he loves about you. He's like, what? I was like, you're pacing like you, you just came out for a minute. He's like, she's like, I don't pace. I was like, yes, you do. I yeah, think you do. Yeah, she does. And then she was just like telling me how Twinkles took her to the fun house and then there was a room with a chair and she didn't understand the feeling she felt like she kept staring at that room. And she said she saw jet skis and she didn't understand why she just kept staring at the jet skis and then she started crying. She's like and I'm sad and I don't know why I'm sad. I don't even know why I'm crying. So I was, I just didn't want to overwhelm her. I, at that moment, I didn't know what it meant until I spoke with City. That I didn't know that that was your guys' first date um, on the jet ski. So she's having, like, you know, the feelings are there when she's in these, like, emotional places that she's been with, with everybody. But it's just, you know, her memory is just not coming back with it yet. Which is why I was pissed off at Ember for pushing her off a bridge when she's fresh out of a freaking brain bleed surgery with amnesia. I hope she's dead. I shot the yuck at Ember yesterday. That I... Or two days ago. I don't well, usually was resort to... Ago? I was seeing red. I was so pissed when I heard that she that happened to her. But even then, when she was explaining her feeling when she saw Aunt, like Ember, she said that she wanted... She didn't understand why she just had this urge to push Ember off the bridge. And I was just like, you know, she's in there. Oh, but it's you know, here's the thing, Kitty. It's technically her, no matter what. It's just the old version of herself. Yeah. The old, empty, lost, confused, broken Ray. But it doesn't help what everybody is doing. Like, Zaki telling her that April left for a man and abandoned her for a man? That's not true. April went Wait, on the tour. Wait, said that? Yeah, Zaki told her that, so she feels lost. Like, she's like, I can't believe... I'm, and she just kept, she kept saying that. I can't believe April left me for a guy. I can't believe she abandoned me. She keeps saying that. And I'm like, she didn't. She would never abandon you. Like, she... Uh, and I told her, and... You might not feel it now, but you have more people that love you, that are here for you. Nobody's abandoning you. But it's just so many people are telling her things and just, like, clouding her mind. Like, Benji saying that they dated and that they have a daughter and, like... <gasps> what? <laughs> Man. 
Benji said that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I was like, no, no, no. I like, I told her, of course. I was like, you still detest the idea of like having kids and all that stuff. Like, you would not. Like, you, you gave me shit for having a kid. I was like, you still have you know as your brother. In fact, you're closer than ever. You guys live together at the clown house. I was trying to like, I was like, Benji's probably just saying that because he fumbled hard in terms of getting you. Like he fumbled really hard and you like friend zoned him hard. Zakid's telling her <laughs> Zakid's telling her that he's her best friend. Um everybody's just like not thinking about her her, you know? Of like, course. <laughs> but I, the greatest thing about it is she wants to talk to you. Uh, yeah, she left me a note in my pocket, but I just haven't heard or seen seen her since. I, I haven't, haven't either. I texted since her. I, woke up. I don't think she's been around. I've been calling her every day. Um, I think she's probably just processing things and just want like she had a like she was here with me for like hours just kind of venting and just talking and she's just like she's like you're the only one that I feel like she hugged me when I first saw her I wanted to hug her but I couldn't because I knew she didn't remember me but after all of our talks she hugged me she's like she's like I just want to hug you she's like thank you and I think it's just a lot what everybody's doing to her because she said some people have even told her to her face that they lied to her about what they told her so she well, doesn't yeah, know the, what to believe. Chang Gang was convincing her that she was just a spy or something. And she kept saying that to me. And she was just a spy. Yeah, so she wants to talk to you. And she was worried that maybe what if you wouldn't remember her when you wake up? And I was like, we'll take one, one thing at a time. He'll, oh, he'll make it through. I forget. Don't give up hope. Don't, I was just... dead, kitty. They said my brain stopped working. They really? Yeah. And, and then Mr. Ratchet said that he was, they were zapping my brain or doing some boy yuck to me. And I start, I must be really yucked up if my, if my brain stopped for a while and then I'm still n normal or whatever the yuck that is. Can, can, can clowns be normal? I don't think so. <laughs> okay. Um, but you still love her, right? Yeah. Okay, thank God. Kid, I, <sighs> I, I have a problem. What's your problem? I think I need to go to Parsons. <sighs> I, I'm, I, 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 I think I wait, I that sleep. was due I, like years ago, but um, um it's it's weird because it's just I go to bed and it's like I don't even feel like I sleep because I'm just reliving things. Of me and her, and then I wake up and it doesn't stop. But I see things from her point of view. Is that yucked up? No. It's like things we did together, but it's I can see myself. Is that isn't that that's not Are you on drugs? No. Hmm. That's why I think I'm, I'm I, I think I think I'm losing it, Kitty. I think there's something wrong with me. Oh yeah, I imagine. I listen, all right. You threatened me when she was she remembered you. I can only imagine what it feels like right now when she doesn't remember you. I don't I don't know. I don't know what to do, Kitty. I'm I'm scared if I if I push too hard, you know, she's just not she's just gonna think I'm a freak. Again, or, or, you know, and if I wait too long, then she's gonna, she's gonna take off because that's what the CG effect does to her. She just leaves because they suck. Um, and, or, or you know, uh, you... Mr. Ratchet, I had Mr. That Ratchet, fear. A, you know Mr. Ratchet, right? Yeah, yeah. He's a yucking idiot, but, but he made, he told me something that I think makes sense. Oh God, which, what did he which, say? He told me that. I, maybe I shouldn't just try to force her to remember, but just read, just start over again, and maybe like read, do, do things for like the second time, you know. Just Fifty kinda... first dates. What? <laughs> he 
seen that movie? Fifty First Dates. What? No, I don't have any TV. Oh frick. Okay. Um. Well, you're just gonna have to date her every single time, and if it yeah, goes bad, how do I date somebody that's afraid of clowns? Ugh. I'm gonna have to. Like, like, I don't want to threaten to kill her again, and then just like, cause that's risky, you know, like. Listen, Chatterbox, if you had told me a year ago that I would fucking love clowns, I would be like, you're fucking crazy. You know, cause, I, and it's kind of ironic because out of everyone, you were the reason why I feared clowns. When you fucking snuck in my car and took me to court center and asked me a question. And if I had answered it wrong, I was going to be dead. Well, you know, it's, <clears throat> um... That but probably I probably had a good reason. Anyway, <laughs> anyways, I had that fear. That's why I was just crying. I was breaking down that day, and Kevin told me, "If you guys got close before, what makes you think you won't be close now?" And that's what it was. I wasn't forcing her to remember anything. I hung out with her, and she felt comfortable. And slowly, bits of her came out. What makes you think you being around her? Doing things that she liked. Like, I mean, obviously, you did it before. I believe you can do it again. Yeah, I just... I have to fight the problem at hand, which is... Chang Gang steering her away from me. That's um, a barrier right now. That is true. But... At least uh, an olive branch is she wants to talk to you. Yeah, that's that's all I got. And if I yuck this up, Kitty, I don't I don't know what to do. You cannot yuck this up, please. I, I didn't go to college, Kitty. I'm freaking the yuck out. I'm I'm, I'm scared. I, I feel like I'm losing my yuck at mine. Like, I, 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 yuck. I bought her a bunch of yuck at rocks because she loves rocks. She likes to throw rocks at people, and she used to have a pet rock a long time ago. It's just I'm hoping this will. You know, help, you know? <laughs> Am I yucking stupid? <laughs> you know, I, it, but it's like the reason why she would love you. Like, who fucking thinks of that? Here, here's some rocks. You fucking love this shit. She does. Th that's exactly <laughs> why she would fall for you again. Most people would be like, oh, here's some roses. I hope you remember me. You're like, here, fuck some shit up. Roses? She's a Changan girl. I know. I know. I know. Carmella she... told her that we hated each other. I... Carmella, <gasps> Carmella's been stirring. Carmella also told her that she 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 got that that Ray got bit on the lease at the auction. But that was really cool. Oh yeah, she told me about that. Oh, I'm gonna punch her right in the yucking face. Oh. <sighs> okay. Okay. Look, Kitty. I um. I think before anything, just that inner, that talk, especially right now where she's amicable to hear you out. She asked, uh, she was asking about the mask, why, like, because everybody was telling her about Gigi, and then uh. she said that, um, she said that when you gave her a gun, you took off her the mask, and then there was just something in her that she just believed you. She said. She, she just believed you, and she felt like you wanted her to shoot you. She, did, she didn't have it in her. I feel like... I, I went, went as far as... Dying to... Help her realize that... Where she's at and where she, where she thinks she belongs is not where she belongs. That's so sick and twisted. What the fuck? Did you ever? What if she remembered when she shot you in that moment? Hello? At least she remembered. The trauma you put her through. That's considered abandoning her! Is it? Listen, okay? Fighting for my bestie means you have to stay alive too, okay? 
choice was hers and she didn't she didn't kill me for some reason oh god i hope she remembers so that she can hit you upside the head for that one wouldn't that be nice <laughs> okay <laughs> um i don't think there's such a thing as where she belongs i think raymond I used to think that it had to be one way or another, but she's so bratty that she can have her cake and eat it too. And she just needs to remember that she can do that. Not many people will tell their gang, hey, don't kill my fucking bestie, but yet Raymond did that. It wouldn't stop them, though. It stopped them. I'm still alive. They, I was on, I was supposed to die. She did, and Max. Yeah, she did fight pretty hard for you. I remember that. Not many people do that with their gangs. But Raymond will because that's my girl. Like, you know, like if she wants it, it's going to happen. Well, look what that gang does for her. Yeah, but we they, also they, just don't they, know. They know how happy she was and, and her own dad shot me in the head, tried to kill me. Or is it just jealousy because they miss her? They don't deserve her. They may I, you know, I can't even say that. I can't even say that because I'll never know what they've been through. You know, they were the ones that were there for her years ago. Yeah, but were they there? I, I genuinely don't know. I, I. Well, put it this way. You see how you talked to her, right? The other day, right? Mm hmm Yeah. Look at the way she, like, just... Just try to relive your conversation the way she looked and sounded. Does that sound like somebody that has people there for her, like truly? Whoa. Holy shit, you should be a therapist. No, I just, I get that because when I first met her, she's, I, I noticed that. I don't know, I just feel like that's why we like became so close was because of that. It's the same yucky way, you know what I mean? I just, uh... I don't know. She's very interesting. <laughs> I'm conflicted, because I could see your point of view. You know? <laughs> so conflicted. It's just like, I'm like not the type to like turn my back on anybody that's been there for me from years ago, so like I would, hate, like, I would never make her choose. But I also know that since meeting you, like... I told her, I was like, if there's anybody that knows you the best, it would be you. Because you know both sides of her. Because she always felt like she had to be tame around me. And she never had to. Like, I knew my best friend was fucking wild. She likes to do dumb, crazy shit. And I lo I'll still love her. But I feel like she was at most herself with you. is because you encouraged her to make her own decisions. Encouraged her to, like, give in to, like, you know... Her urges to want to blow things up, to want to kidnap, like, you know, like, and it's nice. It's freeing to have that. It was just nice seeing her so happy. Yeah. She's definitely happy and comfortable with you, and you, I... She was. She will be. I said, okay, this is the boss level, okay? This is the end boss level. Now's the time! You've got this. If we've got to redo the level 50 million times, we've got it. And you have all of us to back you up. If you want to do something wild, if you want to stage something, like, we're here. We are here. I ha I need some advice then on something. I need your opinion. Oh, God. Okay, on. You remember? Well, I mean, I don't know if she, she probably told you about the whole smelter incident a long time ago, right? With Amber with, and uh, Bonbon and stuff. Yeah. Would it be a yuck? Look, she loves to do yucked up things. Okay. Mm-hmm. She, 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 in a way, she's just as yucked as I am. And let's say I find out, I can try to like talk to her and. You know, hearing her state of mind now, people she doesn't like, and I kidnapped them and, and took her with me and brought them to the smelter, and I got her to throw them in, you think that would, like, 
trick or something? Uh, you know... I had a notebook of triggering things to do with her. If this was just a very chatter cups way of doing it, perhaps? She liked it a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. But we gotta ease her into it, you know? I don't think you did it, like, the first time around and just kidnapped somebody and got her to do crazy stuff, right? No, Maybe no. start something no, light, sure. you know? Maybe, like, get in a chase and have her with you or something. And then ease into that. That's a good idea. To just slowly make my way into more intense boyuk. Yeah. Wait, boyuk doesn't mean fucking? Huh? Oh, never mind, never mind. What? Huh? No, no, it's you know, it's like bullyock and jacked up. <laughs> never mind, never mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry. Hey, okay, okay, all right. Um, okay. Um. Well, to be fair, you're kind of like you're in a good path because when we talked, she wanted to uh kidnap you, tie you up, and then talk to you, and then I was like, ew, yes. no. What if this is your guys's kink? That's my, that is, that's my cups right there. That, that would have been awesome. Yeah. So then I was like, how about, I was like, he just came out, like, he's still in ICU. How about we just try to talk to him? But then now that I think about it, that was so, yep, that probably would have been a better option. Hey. Um, I got no time for you right now, you yucking hillbilly. You're oh. stupid. You, you keep class. talking, Yuck. If you're still here when I get out the hospital, you're dead. You understand? I'm going to kill you. I dare you to stay here. I yuck and dare you. See what happens. Sorry, Kitty. Sorry about that. <laughs> Some yucking hillbilly. I'm yucking around. This is so crazy that... Initially, you were trying to kill her, and you guys are like... Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. I was... I, I, I thought I hated her because she got me stabbed by Yuck and Benji. By the same low life, pe low life piece of Yuck that's yucking, saying this bull Yuck to her that doesn't like her for her, just likes the idea of being with her because that's the type of guy that sack of Yuck is. I'm going to kill him. All right? But yeah. I don't know. And then Mickey, I got to talk to Mickey. Mickey called me and somehow convinced me to... Not kill her and do a different game, you know. You know, just see what would happen. The clown risk and she yucking one because she has this crazy plot armor. And then... And she called me for that stupid date auction. And I showed up there with $200. <laughs> and we still you... won her because Twinkles gave me 23000 yuck of dollars. Oh, give her $23,000. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. I, I have twenty-seven thousand in my pocket right now. You can give her twenty-three, and you can just give me four thousand dollars. Okay. <laughs> Wait, no, just kidding. No, oh, give me my. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, like, well, yeah, maybe if I, maybe if I, set up a fake auction, and that's what I have on my notebook. A Wait, fake what? auction. Oh my! I have God, a notebook. Kitty. Kitty, you gotta set one up. <laughs> well, I'll, we'll get a bunch of people there. We'll, we'll bid on people, and it'll all be like really low numbers, and I'll bid a crazy amount for. Her. <laughs> what if it goes up to a hundred thousand dollars? I'll yuck and pay it. I'll force the clowns to work their yuck off to give me that money. Otherwise, I'll kill them. Oh, you want to know what's number one in my uh, ways to get her to remember? Get somebody sexy to flirt with you. What? <laughs> She claims, she says she's not a jealous girl. I was like, bitch, you're a jealous girl. Holy yuck, yeah, she is. Even yeah. if, if I say hi to somebody, she's ready to kill her. She told me, she told the doctor, Dr. Nancy, that she wasn't allowed to touch me if, if without Cups' consent. So if I was on my deathbed and Dr. Nancy was the only one that could save my life, well, then not to yuck and touch me and let me die. <laughs> because only she can touch me. Is that, is that crazy? She yeah, she's yeah. a jealous one, and she said she's not jealous. She's like, she said, so wait, you. So she said, between me and your Gigi friend, I'm the jealous one. I'm like, yep. <laughs> I was like, I would like you're just bratty. Like you're you just are bratty, and I love it because I'm the same way. And she's like, I'm not jealous. I'm like, okay. I was like, I'll let that one go because you don't remember, but you are. 
Yeah, I, and is. there was another one. I was like sneaking in. Uh, one time I dropped her off to the mines and to meet with you. And then I stuck in the mines to make sure she was okay. And then when I saw she was okay, then I left. It was me and Lottie. Like we snuck in. Wait, whose hair was left in there? I remember that. Uh, <clears throat> probably Lottie's. How the yuck did her hair stay back there? What did you cut it? She was crawling. I told her not to crawl. I was crouching. Oh. She was crawling through the thing. Yeah. I, well, Katie, I'm going to tell you this. Good thing you guys left, because if I saw you guys in there, I was going to execute something. And I didn't Whoa. really... And yeah, never mind. <laughs> well, she said she wouldn't hurt you. I mean, that you wouldn't hurt her. So we snuck in. We saw you guys were talking. And then I was like, okay, well, I don't want to invade their privacy. So then we left. She didn't really know that at the time. And she said that. She barely, she didn't even know me, really, at that time. Another one, which is just soon because you just got out of the ICU, is she sends you off Mount Chiliad. So I remember her telling me that, and she was just so happy. I'll let her do it again, if it helps. And then, another one is, what if you stole her ID? That's how this all started. Yeah, but I didn't steal it directly from her. How did you get it? I was the one that told her to, so to get a new ID. Yeah, she had it was expired, so she threw it in the garbage. And Scruffy found it. So Scruffy came up to me and goes, Hey, you remember this? You, like, do you know who this is? And I'm like, this... I'm like, yeah, this name rings a bell. Uh, I'm like, but I wasn't really sure. Like, I couldn't... I kind of remembered her, but I didn't. I'm like, all y'all can... I need IDs to do yucked up things with. So he gave it to me. And then, we, and then I was in the, the senior buns, and she found out that I had it, so she was pressing me about it. Yeah, I was there. We were running after you, but she was on the phone with Benji, and he just pulls up and stabs you. Yeah, and then I was yucking mad. Ugh. <sighs> yeah, so... Yeah, that's how that happened, and it's probably one of the best things that has ever happened. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> I'm glad she threw it. She was irresponsible and just threw it, threw it like in the... <laughs> like she threw it in the... She didn't even cut it up or nothing. <laughs> I don't know, Kitty. I'm, 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 I'm hopeful. I'm lost. If, if I I'm hopeful, her, I'm lost. I'm but lost I'm not going to lie. Like, with that hope, I have this intense fear because... It could go both ways, you yeah, know? Yes, Either she remembers or she could just completely forget. I can't stay but... here. I'm not, I can't stay here. If, if, she, if, she, if I lose her, I'm, I can't. I can't. I can't. But? I let her, but... In, I let her in my home. I, 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 I opened up my... I literally, like, I have never done something this in, intense. With, like, it's... I, I, I'm done. Kitty, I'm done. Yeah. But... But if just from talking to me, she felt comfortable and she felt safe, I feel like she just needs Daddy. time with you. And if anything, I feel like she just needs time alone with you without the chaos, you know? No matter how awkward it is, because it was fucking awkward in the car when I was with her. But uh. then eventually, eventually, oh, sorry, <clears throat> it was yucking. Uh, awkward in the car. Why do I gotta say yuck? The swearing is bad for your soul. Ain't but no you, way you're telling you know what, me swearing is bad. You know, you know what, it's bad for your soul? Look, look, killing people. No, it's not. No, it's not. It heals the soul. If you kill the right people, it's not a bad thing, kitty. Okay, true, true. Yeah. I've killed a lot of people. And 90% of them deserve I it. I know! I, 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 was, a, I was bad. Kitty, I know I was bad. I was really bad. You but... terrorize us at Roasters! Yeah, but... Oh, at least you just gave me a heads up and would call and be like, Yeah, we're coming to blow it up. Yeah, but... but See, at, even at that time, Kitty, I had my reasons, okay? It wasn't the best, but... Lang Buddha and Carmella were were, were, were... were doing bad things to me. They, they were yucking with me. And I, I, I had enough. I had enough. I gave okay. Lang an option... Mm -hmm. To just to, 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 to end things, all he had to do was fire Carmella, and he and I said, if you don't, I'm I'm attacking employees, I'm blowing that place to smithereens, and he said, yuck the employees and yuck you, and hung up on me. So if you want to think about it, that's his fault. Mr. Link said that. Yeah. Wow. I'm reasonable. 
sometimes. Right, right. I come a long way. I don't lie. I don't love who I was before. I, I no, kind you of have. somewhat I've... okay with who I was in the last couple of months, but now I don't know. You gotta be. Listen, okay? I, well, I can't go you have to, to be the chatterbox that she fell for. But without, well, without her, I can't. Without her, I can't. Well, woo -hoo, woo -hoo. let's not put that out in the universe. There is no without her because she has no choice. I even told her, I was like, I'm being timid right now, but bitch, you, I told her, I was like, you hold know. On, hold on. Did you huh. call her? No, that's not, I'm not calling her a bitch. She, it's, it's something I picked up from her. She does that. She's like, ooh, bitch. Okay, it's a saying okay, that she all does. Right, all right, okay, all right. I would never call her that. Okay. Anyways, I told her that if I had forgotten her, she would have kidnapped me and whacked me in the head to remember her. And it's just true. I told her, I was like, this is so true, but if, if the tables were turned, you would be Wait. so offended that I forgot you. She said Wait. she'd whack you in the head to remember her. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Brain bleed. Hello. Brain we can't do oh, that. Yeah, the brain bleed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. brain bleed. <laughs> oh, my God. I need to watch Look, what I say around you. You could die from a brain, ble a brain bleed, right? I know. Okay, so yes, why you can. Have, how come there are so many people that saw her before I did when, when like, she got... She got rescued from this island, right? And uh, what the yuck is this? We need to talk. Vinny, Vinny, get away from me right yucking now. Me and you are talking after that phone call. You were getting in my car, and we're gonna Kitty, go have I... a long conversation. Kitty, I gotta get off go. the phone right now. Uh, okay.